because there are quite a few people outside the island and even in the island who um, might be learning it independently mm-hmm. um Jerry, what what advice would you give to them um you know when you when you think you're stuck don't give up because um if you keep at it you'll get it um i found at least that there's there seem to be always people who are willing to help so don't mm. be afraid to ask for help um don't be too hard on yourself like the I, I still I still am nervous sometimes about speaking it but I really had to get past this idea that like I wasn't going to speak until I felt like it could be perfect I mean that's just yeah. a disaster philosophy for trying to learn a language right like you just you just have to make mistakes so get over yourself maybe yeah I know <laughs> I think that's probably the best advice possible actually just sort of you know sod it Speak, really. It just is going to happen. Yeah. I mean, yeah. I think, I, yeah, I, you learn more when you make mistakes too, because that's when you figure out it'll it'll stick in your head when yeah. you've made that mistake. Um, and repetition. Like I just do stuff over and over and over again. And I think also like you'll get out of it what you put into it. So if it's your goal to, you know, have a couple of of words you can do that yeah if it's your goal to be able to talk to your child you can do that if you want to be able to read you know novels in manx like you can do that it just is depends on how much yeah you know how much time you're going to spend on it so i i I spent a lot of time that first couple of years and i still do but you know i will say I, i i at the beginning I was like coming home from work and like that's what I would do after work for a couple of hours right so when people are like isn't it weird that you well I I, I have to own that I was like probably spending more time on it than the average person (laughs) yeah but you're right you put in you, you get out of it what you put into it and then 